here on behalf of the uh, party, the, especially the Sodelpa Women's uh, Forum, which is the constitutional arm of the party. It is a very, very important uh, arm and very, very active. You will know that uh, last year we um, had a Pintoba, I think some of you were here. Mm -hmm. We were able to raise funds and that was a very good uh, opportunity for us mm -hmm. to help the Cancer Society. And then we also had the November, uh, that was for prostate uh, cancer, I think it was in uh, November. Mm -hmm. And we had the um, breakfast uh, last uh, Saturday. So the AGM is on this Saturday. And we have people coming from all over the country. They are women uh, from our different uh, constituencies and branches. And we are looking forward to, to them coming so that we can look at some of the opportunities that uh, we have working together and working towards the, uh, the election. Uh, I think that's, uh, that's it. And uh, we hope to see more of each other in the future. And I think there's a need for that. That's it. Ma'am, what, what, what are just some of the topics that, that will be discussed during the AGM? Um, the meeting is going to be held on Saturday. Okay. okay. What we are looking at is just to confirm some of the uh, appointments that were already made at the, uh, I think it was the AGM and the law about, uh, uh, because we didn't have an AGM last year uh, in which we were supposed to make those confirmations, so we are doing it. Uh, and that's for the executives of the, the party. Moving forward, and we want to look at some of the programs that we want uh, to put together. The, the women from the different constituencies will look at in terms of getting their own uh, people, their own candidates off the ground. So Ma'am, just reading through the statement, it's uh, said that the one of the agendas of the meeting is to discuss issues affecting uh, party supporters. Mm -hmm. What issues are these? It's very well known to you, some of our uh, issues. And uh, we want to, you know, just look at a new uh, narrative where we are not reacting, but proactive, so that we can work together in terms of just getting the party to consolidate and uh, to move forward together where we are not distracted other things and other agenda, so we are working towards it. Can I answer your question? Can you, you know, as someone who has been uh, there for long, ma'am, uh, maybe can you confirm, uh, you know, the status of uh, human supporters in the party? Has there been an increase or a drop in, uh, in terms of now that Linda Tambue has left the party, we believe she has taken her supporters as well, you know? Uh, for us, because uh, this party started off as SDL, and uh, the SDL had a very uh, strong support from the women. And we see that that support is still there. Uh, we saw that at the prayer breakfast, uh, I think many, many people who came to that prayer breakfast last Saturday were very surprised. Because the one thing with the women, they don't believe everything that's uh, in the media. Sorry, I mean, no offense to you people, eh? But they don't believe everything that's in the media. They look beneath and beyond, so they get to the true story rather than the distractions that are put out there. So I believe that the women who will make up maybe 50% of the voters, they are very much uh, still with us. And what are some of the issues that Sadapa women uh, feel or believe should be fixed, uh, like the uh, nation or? I think uh, for the, uh, because the Sadapa has always been with indigenous issues, eh? And so they are very much with that. Mm -hmm. And also mm -hmm. democracy, because we we don't believe in coups, we don't want our children, to, uh, many of whom now, you know, have been born, uh, were born during the coup times and uh, that has taken us backwards so we have to rebuild the economy uh, education we want for our uh, for our children uh, we need to put an education commission in place uh, because we had one in 1999 that was 
uh, followed by the adhered to by the uh, Ministry of Education until 2007. And now we have all sorts of things happening in um, in education, so we have to reset that one. Uh, we have to look at uh, also SMEs. You know, SMEs the you know really looked after the really looked after the um, the families when we had the lockdown, eh? and it was especially the women. You know, selling curry and roti, selling things. And they were able to keep their family uh, going during those uh, difficult times and putting food on the table. And of course health. Mm -hmm. Health is a really, really big issue. So those are just some of the things that uh, I think that the women uh, are concerned about. Thank you, Madam. I, we have to go. You've got a meeting to chair. One last question. Um, How many percent of female candidates are they looking at uh, to have in the next general election? Well, I'm going to be very, very ambitious. So, and we're just looking at 30. 30%. Okay. Okay, so, you know, have a look at women. So we're actively headhunting women. Because I believe, not just because you're a woman, yeah, because I believe that women can make a difference. It's an international do you think, yeah. do you think, well, that, do you think that the women forum will be able to come with a common idea now with Linda Tampoy missing from the party? Uh, Linda, I can say she was a very good member of the party. Okay? And we uh, learned a lot from uh, Linda. She worked very hard uh, for us. She was a good whip. Now she's gone to another party. We just wish her well. Yes. Can, can, you just, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. can you just confirm? Just, can you just uh, confirm if you're standing in this election and under the Sodal program? And you know very well why are you asking me that question. I'm just that like Andrea first, because people you, are starting you, to ask you, the question. You answered uh, like asking the parliament member. You said that you were not going to run for election. Because this is the same thing that you told us in 2014 when you said in 2018 election. My word is only one word. If it's yes, it's yes. If no. it's no, it's no. Come on, me, I can buy.